Hello everyone, this is King Kong LT. This is the rapid news of our new product. Uh, this is KC868A4 smart controller. Uh, this is our new design controller. Uh, the max advantage is this all is open source for the MCU code. And uh, this is used uh, ESP32 Wi-Fi module. It also supports the Bluetooth. So you can use any code. You can change and modify any code and download to the module by Arduino IDE. So it's easy to program and you can write any code for any functions just you need it. So this board for IoT learner and for smart home automation DIY and for school education. So this is for you to learn the IoT technology is very good because it have many parts, uh, have many functions. I will tell you uh, all the hardware resources and in future we will make many video toys and lessons about based on this board how to program and how to use and what function will be uh, will be to do uh, with this board okay let's look at the hardware resources this is our A4 controller why we named A4 because A means it can write the code by Arduino so we can use the A for this name and the 4 is the fully output channel. This is 4 channel. In future, maybe we will release a new product for a different channel. Okay, let's look at the hardware resource. Uh, this is DC 12 voltage input. And uh, this is IS232 point. And uh, this is full digital input. Just a, a dry contact. And this is DS uh, 18B20 a temperature sensor, but you can use a DHT11 or DHT21. That is the temperature and the humidity sensor from this point. Uh, this is for temperature and the humidity sensor. And uh, we can see this. This is DAC. That is two channel for DC 0 to 10 voltage output. Uh, you can use for dimmer or change the motor speed. Uh, you can use this point. And this is ADC in, it is import uh, that support this two point support DC 0 to 5 watt sensor. And this is support uh, 4 to 20 uh, milliampere uh, sensor. So this is for analog sensor. Uh, you can use uh, temperature, humidity, and uh, pressure, and the uh, soil, CO2 and what level, many, many analog sensors use these four points. And uh, this is ESP32 module. Uh, this support Wi-Fi and the support Bluetooth. Uh, just you can choose which one you will to use. And uh, this is the option, the resistant option for this, use this PCB antenna or use this extended antenna. Uh, just uh, it's up to you. And uh, this is IR receive, inferred IR receive. Uh, this can learn the remote uh, from this point. And this is IR send. It can send the IR signal. Uh, like you can use this receive and learn your TV and air conditioning buttons. And this is send signal to country TV or air conditioning by this transmit. And uh, this is RF. Uh, 433 megahertz receive module and this is RF uh, transmit module. Also you can use uh, RF frequency is 315 megahertz. Uh, just it's up to you. You can change this module for wireless receive and wireless send. And this is the USB port, mini USB. This is for uh, connect with your PC or connect with your Mac to download the code to the ESP module. And this is two button. This button one is for reset for the module. And this is a function button you can define for your program you need. And this is for relay output. This for relay uh, max support, you can see a max support uh, AC 277 voltage and 10 ampere. This is a max uh, the voltage and uh, all the relay output have COM, NC and NO, just the common line and uh, normal close and normal open.
uh, I will really have three points. This three point for this, and this three point for this, and this three point for this. And uh, you can see this is the back of the PCB board. And this is speak. Uh, you can uh, make alarm application. Uh, this will be speak very loudly sound. This is the speak. So this is the board. Uh, you can see the many functions you can use and just write code uh, by the ES32 relay module. Okay, thanks for watching.